six of the seven accused in the Kathua rape case, the rape and murder of a young eight-year-old child, a little girl, have now been convicted. And we're getting reactions coming in. The former Chief Minister Mehbooba Mufti there has tweeted right now saying, I welcome the judgment. It's high time we stop playing politics over a heinous crime where an eight-year-old child was drugged, raped repeatedly and then bludgeoned to death. I hope the loopholes in our judicial system are not exploited and that the culprits get exemplary punishment. Let's uh, go across to Nazir Masoodi. Uh, Nazir, what is the latest you're hearing? As of now, six of the seven accused convicted. This includes the main accused, that retired revenue officer Sanji Ram. Uh, but as uh, Mehbooba Mufti points out, the culprits should get exemplary punishment. According to the law, they either face a minimum of a sentence of life imprisonment or a maximum of death penalty. But that, of course, will only be uh, after the quantum of punishment is announced. Well, Sarah, six uh, accused have been convicted of rape, murder, abduction, and also destruction of evidence, which include one sub-inspector and a Hawalda. This is a historic judgment. One accused have been let off. He has been acquitted because of uh, lack of evidence or he has been given benefit of doubt. So he has been acquitted, but it's a huge victory for the prosecution. And finally, the little girl has got justice. We'll have to wait for the quantum of punishment, what that punishment would be. All of them have been convicted, six have been convicted. But what will be now the punishment? And also, what we try and do now do to the juvenile who has been, whose case has not been yet been charge sheeted because crime branch has filed a case before the High Court, Dominion High Court, All right. wherein they are saying the main accused, the juvenile, he is right. not a juvenile, he is an adult.